Hey, what's going on, guys? Rusty Wrapping Paper here. You can call me Doom Dad or Doom Fun Dad. I'm not quite sure which one I want to go by yet, but either way, I'm your father. Not really, but I am doing this commentary, so it's pretty much the same thing, right? So, yeah, it's, this is a solo triple nuclear on Nuketown, and you don't really actually see a whole ton of solo triple nuclears. That's actually kind of crazy to happen because that's, think about that, that's 90 kills that you have to get pretty much consecutively. I know you have to, you get a little break every time you get 30, but um, essentially it's 90 kills that you have to win. You have to win 90 gunfights in a row, uh, which is a pretty ridiculous thing to do when you're playing solo. You have no teammates helping you out. I'll, I'll, you, you guys know how bad the teammates are when you're playing just solo. Your teammates are always going like 2 and 42, and they're, I don't know, they're just looking at the map. They're always running the highest kill streaks they possibly can instead of UAVs and, and things that actually are productive. They're always like running dogs and stuff that they can't get because they see all these gameplays that, and then they try and imitate it. But who wouldn't want to accomplish this? This is pretty incredible to say the least. This is by uh, Doom Sharp Hitter. I was about to say Amp Sharp Hitter there, but because I, I've done a few commentaries for him. Uh, when when he was a part of AMP, when we were all a part of AMP, but um, as you guys know, it is now Doom. We've made the the transition. It's we've been up for a good two weeks now, almost, and uh, it's been pretty awesome. Uh, one great thing about Doom is like with all these really great players, you're never not gonna have an insane gameplay to watch because these guys are all like think about this. Think about it this way. So our leader. Well, let's let's take Jay Nasty for um, instance here. So Jay Nasty's an incredible player, right? Uh, but he he can only play so much to get gameplays. Um, but then when you have like 30 members all going for gameplays, you're basically never not going to have a, a top tier gameplay to upload. So uh, this is one of them, and it's by Doom Sharp Hitter. His channel is is Sharp Hitter. His name uh, he likes to go by Gameplay Boost and. Um, that's not Gameplay Booster. I know that's one of Jane Nasty's account, but his name is Gameplay Boost. So yeah, man, make sure to go and subscribe to him in the description below, right next to Player. It should say his YouTube account is Sharp Hitter, like I said, and uh, just go and subscribe. He has a ton of gameplays that, and he's constantly pumping them out. He's just a, a ridiculous player. And uh, if you want to go and subscribe to me, I'll be right where it says Commentator in the description. I do quite a few videos as well I, I post high scores and you know if you want to check me out that's all cool beans awesome stuff so what I wanted to talk to you guys about today is kind of on the topic of rage I know a lot of people you know rage is it's kind of tied into the call of duty you know community everyone really likes to get mad when they die so I wanted to talk about that for a second and what you can kind of do to reduce your rage. I just did a commentary about this on my channel and uh, people really enjoyed it. So I thought I might in, uh, bring it to this channel. So now one thing that my friends thought of, which was actually a, a genius idea, and I recommend you guys try it, is when you play, go on Pandora.com and search nature in the little in the little search bar and that'll bring up nature radio. Now, <laughs> I know what you guys are thinking, like you guys are thinking that this is going to be freaking stupid and you're I don't really I don't know exactly what you're thinking but that's probably something on the lines of that and uh I promise you if you listen to nature radio on pandera.com while you play call of duty you probably won't rage I I'm just saying it right now because when you're listening to sounds of like trees bristling in the wind and like j birds chirping and shit like you are not really concentrated on the guy that you that just killed you by teleporting through the wall and you're not going to get as mad and uh if you if you just listen to it 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 should help you concentrate a little bit i mean you're not really you're not really thinking about the game so much and you're just kind of going out and playing it and so like all right so when you die and you start raging, you start playing the game with your emotions, and that can really get in the way, and you'll start playing kind of bad because you'll just you'll just be so angry, and you'll be shouting at the at the screen, and uh, I don't know who knows maybe you f rip a door off of, of of your room and just throw it out the window. Whatever you do when you get mad, you don't want that because you're gonna start playing the game with your emotions. So if you turn on nature radio and you listen to that, then I swear you'll be so concentrated. I tried it out and I got a few gameplays doing it. It actually surprisingly works. And uh, you guys can take my word for it on or not, but I decided it was something cool enough to share with you guys. Another thing is um, I heard somewhere that 
the scent of peppermint actually reduces road rage, so I, I don't know if that would help with Call of Duty rage, but it's it's a thought and it, it might help. So I like I just when I heard that I had like this little vision of like the next Call of Duty tournament, all the MLGs have a, a peppermint scented candle at their little station and they're all just so concentrated and they're not even caring if they die or anything, but I don't know, it's just a thought. But make sure if you do try the nature radio thing, it is standard issue that you put your clan tag as calm, that's C-A-L-M, when you listen to the nature radio. It's pretty much just a standard issue. <laughs> something my friends and I made up. So uh, we've been trying it out, and it actually works. We've gotten a few gameplays with the with the calm strategy, the nature radio tactic. So uh, my friends told me to try it out. I did, and uh, I'm a believer in the nature radio. It, it helps. It saves lives. But, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Uh, reduce your rage by 23.8 plus pi to the ninth percent and uh, that's a very it's a very accurate um, percentage if you do need to know that it's I, I checked it at least three times and so yeah that's pretty much the gameplay is wrapping up I hope you guys enjoyed the commentary and the gameplay make sure like I said to go and subscribe to the player and uh, yeah it's pretty much wrapping up he's just going balls to the wall rushing right now and uh, I don't know how he did it but it happened, got the triple nuclear. And one last thing, he does end up losing this game, which is a little bit unfortunate. But if I had to choose between getting a triple nuclear or winning the game, to be honest, I'd probably choose the triple nuclear because you can win any other time. And a triple nuclear, playing solo to say the least, a triple nuclear is something that doesn't really happen too much, uh, especially solo. So I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. Make sure to leave a like rating. It's been awesome to see the support you guys have shown on the Doom channel. Make sure to subscribe to Doom and uh, see more gameplays like this. You can also subscribe to the player or me, the commentator, in the description. But either way, man, have a nice day. I'm out. Peace.